Let's cover a method where we can systematically obtain a large value of n0 for a small constant c. And recalling in the big O inequality, we had c times f of n on the right hand side. But typically when we look at algorithms, c is equal to 1. So we basically break up the terms in the function t of n and divide f of n on the right hand side by the number of terms in the time complexity function. And then we check that each term in the function satisfies these inequalities with 1 on r by f of n on the right hand side and thereby obtain a value of n0 for each case and take the largest one which is best illustrated in an example. So here we're showing t of n is less than or equal to n log n or o n log n. So therefore the number of terms is 2 so we divide the right hand side by 2. So we have 1 half n log n and then check these inequalities individually for each term. So starting with 10 n we check if it satisfies this inequality and we do the same thing with 40 log n. So that's less than or equal to 1 half by n log n. And then doing some algebra so in the first case we multiply through by 2 and then divide through by n. So we get 20 is less than or equal to log n. And for the second case we multiply by 2 and divide through by log n. So that gives 80 is less than or equal to n. So if we take 2 to the power of both sides of this expression that further gives 2 to the power of 20 is less than or equal to n. So taking the larger of the two, an n value that's greater or equal to 2 to the power of 20, where we use c equals 1, satisfies this inequality. Please subscribe, like and comment to help me reach more students.